So let's do the min max function in Excel. So this could be good if you have a lot of data and you want to see the minimum value or maximum value. So all you have to do is equals min and my n and I'm going to just search an entire column A. And one's the minimum number. As you can see, one's the lowest. And if I did equals max, and I'll also do column A, 17's the maximum number. So if if I put a zero here, it would, the min would be zero now. Or if I put 100 here, the max would be 100. So it's just a good way to look through lots and lots of data to identify minimum, maximum, and uh, you can use that for calculation purposes. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like it if you did.